Every Christian has a deep desire given by the Holy Spirit to be like Jesus. We know that Jesus is more than just a good example, but we also know that Jesus' life is the perfect pattern of what faithful love for God and love for people looks like. So we all want to be more like Jesus. But this is not as simple as it seems. One reason is the best pictures we have of what Jesus is like come from the Gospels. The Gospels didn't come with an instruction manual saying, over here Jesus is being a good example, imitate that. Over here Jesus is being the Son of God, don't try to imitate that. So to get this right, we need some careful teaching. Unfortunately, most of our churches are not going to offer that kind of careful teaching. For a variety of historical reasons, most Protestant churches just steer clear of the whole idea of imitating Christ or being like Him. This creates a vacuum in which the people who have the most to say about imitating Christ are least careful about it. And so we get ideas like, Jesus was a nice man, you go try to be nice too. So in this book, I'm trying to offer a better way, not neglect, not abuse. I've tried to be ruthlessly biblical. I've been studying this topic in Luke's Gospel for about 15 years. So I'm trying to ask, according to Luke, who is Jesus? What is he like? And in what ways should a disciple of Jesus be like Jesus? And then maybe most importantly, according to Luke, how does that kind of growth and transformation actually take place in our lives? I try to be very practical. I'm a father, I'm a husband, I've been a pastor, I'm a teacher of pastors. I know that generic answers don't help anybody. So we want to ask, what does this look like in my world, in my day-to-day -day life? And finally, I've tried to be pastoral, trying to be encouraging. I don't want anybody to pick up this book and walk away feeling beaten up or discouraged. The best thing I can do then is to continually point readers to Christ. That's the, that's the place where the encouragement, the strength for this kind of growth is going to come from. So pick it up, dive in, let's see what we learn together.